So hey guys and welcome to another Retro Games for Cheaters with me, Supernautus, and today we are playing it's a 1994 Capcom release for Disney Interactive Studios and it's based on a television series of the same name. It is Bonkers. He is a police officer type thing and the whole idea in this game is we have to recover some stolen treasures. You'll see how it works. Here he is, Bonkers, the police bobcat type guy. Uh, we're playing this game with infinite health. Uh, lives, uh, bombs, and dash power, and all the rest of it. We'll see how it goes. Uh, so yeah, let's get going. Some people might think you're bonkers, but you know. And some weird, I don't know, purple duck guy has stolen everything. Here we are. Hey, Lucky, look at this. It says here, an unidentified thief made off with three of Hollywood's most valued treasures. I'll alert the Smithsonian, he says. This is for real. Someone swiped the sorcerer's hat from Fantasia, the mermaid's voice from the little mermaid, of course, and the magic lamp from Aladdin. Just once can we get assigned to a case before we dive in head first. Lucky, these are Toondom's most priceless contributions to the world. This thief has got to be stopped before he steals them again. Um, <laughs> Bunkers, calm down. You're going to make me ah crash the car. Because of course you are. Bunkers on the case. No clues yet. And Toon Museum robbery. Can't stand to see you like this, partner. A devoted public servant reduced to this. But don't worry. I'll find the culprit. No, Bonkers, really. You've done enough. I won't rest until I see justice done. So let's get started. First level, we're in the streets. We've got dash power. Um, basically, run super fast. We can throw bombs, which are infinite. We've got infinite lives, and also we've got infinite health. And if we smash up these balloons... We get all sorts of things. Beat the enemies by throwing bombs at them. Uh, he was the pitch was up, but it wasn't good. Yeah. So, what can we say about this game? Well, it was based on a relatively popular series. I mean, it was you know. Of the time. I pitched over my head. That would be a ball. Be one step towards taking a walk. Who's this guy? Oh, we got something off him. An extra life. The one thing we don't need. Yeah, and you could run into them and kill them as well. Diving board. To get across there. Oops. But you can also jump on your enemies to kill them. And watch you don't get burned alive by the barbecue grills. I know he's a police officer, but I don't think he wants to be grilled. And we got a heart. So that give us, it gives us an extra heart in our health bar, not that it matters much. We're on to the next area. Hey, maybe we can see if we can track down any extra heart pieces. It's just a golden Donald Duck. That's why I think of a golden Donald Duck, and now I've got a constant dash. It would appear... Another potion to continue dashing. Is that like the is that like a Beauty and the Beast type candlestick? There we go. 
Let's ride the thing. Obviously, if we didn't have infinite bombs... Wah, wah, wah. <laughs> I pitched, pitched a good one there. I was hit by a pitch. Take my base. What's up here? Another heart, look. We've got five hearts now. Oh, he's respawned, but he's gone. And that just launched me the other way. Gone from behind. And he's down as well. Can't get up there. Doesn't matter. Let's dash on to the next part. Is it a boss fight? It looks like it might be. But there's a vacuum cleaner there. It's a ghost. That doesn't seem to be killable by... Oh, wait, I see. Now what's he going to do? Take on the vacuum. No, he's going to materialize as an actual person. So that's what we need to do. Deal with him as he materializes. Obviously, he's going to jump into an inanimate object, whatever happens. Easily dealt with. And then every time we just hit him with the, with our only weapon, really. There we go. That's what Dyson have been missing. A ghost. A ghost vacuum. And that's him dead. I don't think they have, to be honest. And there are other, uh, there are obviously other brands available. Mansion stage cleared. We got a roll of paper, it looks like. Some kind of scroll. Luminous figure behind bars in only five minutes and four seconds. Map gives key evidence. Chief admits bonkers might need a little help. I guess we're going on to the studios of this particular... We know who it is. Oh, nice. Nice bounce there. Does this blow up? No. What's he got? He's got like a he's got like a a, sh a riot shield, and he's throwing spanners at me. Gone. Oh, there's a heart up there. Question is, can I get to it? Not easily, is the answer. Gone. So how do we get to that one, I wonder? We can only stand on the end of the... Maybe if I... No, maybe not. We don't need it anyway. There goes my idea of finding them all. Gone. Okay. Oh, we got electrocuted. Don't stand there, you'll get electrified. I need to be up there. No. There we go. Well, we got something with our explosives there. I'm not. Oh, oh no! Now we're covered in red paint. And we're back up. Back up on here, but watch out for those broken lights. Out for those broken studio lights. Oh no! Get out of the paint. He's just been repainted. Oh, electrocution again. It's not nice. 
It's not nice to be electrified. Now I can... What's this? They're like aliens? I guess that's what they're supposed to be. Unidentified flying object. Oh. Oh, and that like tears through the through the set. That's interesting. Don't really need to worry too much about that set. All we have to do is get through the level. To the next section of the game. The next part of the studios. Oh, cactus. Doesn't like cacti. Well, you wouldn't like sitting on one either, would you? It's understandable, really. Oh, that didn't work. Two guns at once. Got him. Got him. Squished his head. If I go back, I'll have to fight one of them again, but he's easy enough to get rid of. This guy, if you can get him, gives you something, but I don't know how to get up there. Oh, careful. I might get killed. Ba -da -ba -ba. Oh, the, I fell right on a cactus. Oh, let's forget about that. There we go. Ah, got him. Got him. Not so difficult. Yeah, so this was obviously, as I say, based on a Disney kind of kids TV series. Um, not one I watched, I have to admit. I was probably a little bit above its target audience at the time that it came out. Kangaroo waiting at the end of a conveyor belt to throw something at us. And the bombs will come back to us if we use them there. He threw banana skins on it. And bombs as well. So, is this the next boss? Oh no. to press that. Ah, see, that's where infinite lives is a bit more helpful, <laughs> because if we fall off there, we have to obviously... I don't know how we press the button. So how do we get that? It says to press that, but I don't see how. Unless I get that by doing... Can't move. Oh, there we go. Unless I do that by running and jumping at it. I lost him. Okay. I don't know how I get him though. Aha! Like that. It is a dash. It is a dash. Uh oh. Which will gradually knock off the things. Get up, get up, get up! Ah. So There's a dash and a jump, but obviously if I. If I have to, if I die, I have to fight both of them all over again. That one's easy enough to get rid of. Just jump on his head until... No! Oh, 
Maybe I don't need to worry so much about getting them off. I think I do, because... Right, he's gone. And then I am. Damn! <laughs> oh, that's annoying. There's a dash attack we need to do on the... On the uh, button on the other side. But we got to knock this guy off first, really. He went straight at me there. Right, dealt with him. Need to wait for the dash to charge back up. Oh, and then not run on a banana skin as I get there. <laughs> Damn. Okay, this time. This time we're going to do it. Got him. Right. Oh, I haven't got a dash yet. And I missed it. Watch out for the banana skins. And then jump back. Got it. Just. Right. Oh no! It limited him to only being there, but... This this boss fight is really annoying. Got him. Right. No, 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 no! Have I just got him trapped? Oh, here come the banana skins. Get up, get up, get up. Uh, I don't want to have to do this again. Get up. Just as I do the dash, he throws a bomb at me. There he is. Got him. We got Aladdin's lamp. After a few attempts. Excuse me, my eye. We got Aladdin's lamp. Wooly and Bully and Slammer in only six minutes and nine seconds. Yeah, if you exclude all the times I failed. Chief says he's finished War and Peace. Well, he can't have done that in six minutes. Where are we now? A street. Near you, perhaps. There is something in the bin. It's a rat in the bin. Well, I don't care about bin rats. Go on. Oh, the bees come in. Got him. I want that. Okay, let's keep moving. <laughs> you can get electrocuted by neon signs. Like that. <laughs> I just found that out and I immediately got hit by another one. I guess I can probably dash through these. Oh, get that bee, because it's annoying me. Oh, is that a shopping bag? That's a handbag? I don't know. It's up here. A cake. If anyone wants a cake, that's where it is. 
Ah. Uh -huh. I can jump on it though. Does being on top of that help me in any way? Not really. You can get squished though. And then I get knocked straight back off if I get squashed, okay. Oh, how do you get past this then? There we go. Up, 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 up. You get an, an extra life from him when you blow him up, I guess. Uh oh, car coming. Just have to jump over them. Or else you get squished. Yeah, and you can't stop yourself getting squished. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh. Uh, it's like a it's like a wily e. coyote getting splattered on the wall. Okay, run. Yay, we got through the barrier, whatever that was for. We were on the freeway. You shouldn't run on the freeway, highway, motorway, whatever you prefer to call it. In the country of your choice. We're getting run over by scooters now. There we go, that's what I think of that. Ah, uh, we've drunk the thing that makes us go really fast. Ah, uh, I bumped a wall and finished myself there. Another one though. Hopefully the next boss isn't nearly as annoying as the last one was. I don't know what you just gave me there. I could just dash through them, but I don't have any dash power. There we go. What's he doing? Throwing plant pots at my head? Are we painting? Oh, that's alright. They can't. I got one. It's bonkers! The bonkers police bobcat. Really? Well, that's not annoying at all. Got him. Right, we have to get hit by that, but we're okay now. Is that donuts? Oh, really? How did a bee survive inside a balloon? Are we being serious right now? Should it? Should I say? How can a balloon survive a bee being inside it? Impossible, surely. Never mind. Let's go. We're on to the next. Uh, looks like the next boss fight. Unless we don't have any pits to fall down, we should be all right. It's uh. It's Batfink on his helicopter. It's not. I guess we just gotta keep hitting the helicopter with bombs. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba -ba. Oh, we got him, we got him, we got the bat. Uh oh. And again, another hit. Another solid hit. Oh, there he is. And again. Aha! Green helicopter down. What did we get? We got the magic hat. We got the sorcerer's hat from Fantasia. And there's only one last item that we need to find, which is Ariel's voice. Toon helicopter in big house in only four minutes and five seconds. Sorcerer's hat recovered. Chief says pieces slowly falling into place. 
Oh, not slowly. I mean, I've managed to clear a couple of them quite quickly. We're on a ship. I'm on a boat, mother. I'm on a boat, mother. It's a bit of a cross between uh, Norman Bates and... Um, that band whose name I've forgotten. Lonely Island? I did that song, I'm on a boat, you know. Oh, you're dropping golden acorns on me. And there's a... There's a broom. Look, we got the Fantasia thing back, so can you not send brooms after us, please? Let's go! Okay, apparently hitting him is not acceptable. Unacceptable! Okay, so the barrels are a problem. If you let them be. And it's raining now. It's raining on board this vessel. I don't even care about the angry sailors. That's where the barrels are all coming from. Get lost, kangaroo man. It's not raining anymore. We managed to avoid the rain for, mo for longer than was required. Oh, cactus. Obviously that was going to hurt us because it's a cactus in a game. Drop your acorns on me. Okay, we, we, we did that bit, I guess. Did we? I don't know. That's the first time we ended the level like that. Now here we are. We're inside uh, some sort of bees and balloons again. I mean, that's some some sort of rubberized beehive. I don't know. Maybe it is. Probably not though. We can't bounce on the sofa cushions to get any higher jumps. Apparently we can jump on the pot plants, though. Not very far, but, you know, we can jump on the, plop, the pot plants. Donuts. Bit of donut time. And he's the worst pool player ever. Probably because he might be playing snooker. There's an extra life under there. Can I get that? Yes, you do a dash and a duck. Duck, dash, dodge, duck and dodge. I don't know. That's not that's not the right selection of phrases I know, but you know. Can I jump on that? No. Oh, and every time I jump there I get flamed. Flame on, bunkers. I don't need to worry about little rats in the bin. Ratatouille, or Remy as is his name. Oh, penguin. That's a swordfish. It's a penguin out of Fight Club. Slide. Let's go! That's it. Flames. Oh, I'm frozen. Let's get out of here. And these penguins, they want you. They want to eat me. Penguins don't eat people, right? We're next. On to the next boss, maybe. Is this where we recover the voice of a mermaid? No! What the hell? He can make holes in the ground where you're standing. Didn't even get a chance to dodge that. Jump! Okay. So, not only does it make holes in the ground, but it also blows you towards that hole if you're not careful.
Ah, that was a bit better. If I'm over there... No! I just walked myself right off the edge. So it goes from... So it's got two easy bosses and two that have been a little bit annoying so far. Stay. If I stay there, it seems like it can't hit me. But I'm too close if I stand there. Got him. An easy boss to defeat, just as long as you don't get blown down the hole. Is that Ariel's voice? I think that might be her voice. Toots, what is it? They found the criminal. You think the collector is the mastermind behind all the burglaries? Oh yeah, but why did he give it to other people? I'll teach him to mess with Bunkers D. Bobcat. I guess we will, because here we go. Laos sent up the river in only eight minutes and five seconds. Mermaid's voice recovered. Chief please with progress, as he should be. There's a sewer. Do we go down the sewer? I would imagine we do, because there doesn't appear to be anywhere else we can't... Oh, that would have been bad. Bit of uh, ducking and rolling to go on, on here, I think. Can't do that when the crocodile's here. But we can do that. Oh, we can't go that way. If we go that way, we'll fall down. Off a ledge, is my thought. The last thing you want right now, though, is see if you hit an enemy. As you're going along, that would just be a bit of a pain. Can't go anywhere here. Oh, we can go there though. Got that one. Uh, oh yeah, there we go. Extra life there that I can't get to. I think we need to run up this once our dash is fully charged. Doesn't matter. Am I supposed to do something with that? Maybe if I dash it. I would have thought that that was how I got past this, but I don't see how you're supposed to... Doesn't uh, work by flipping that switch. Okay, maybe it's not that way we're supposed to go. Although I can't see how it would be any other way, considering we can't go anywhere else. Considering that's the only option for a place to go. How do we get that open? Maybe I'll try dashing it just to see what happens. Yeah, there we go. I should have just done that, to be honest. Oh, we've got more... Need to be facing the right way. Count. Okay, so how do we do this then? Can I jump on top of that?
Uh, he can't dash for long enough to actually... long enough to do it. As soon as you do that, you're stuck. And then I do that, and it just makes it worse. And then you can't... There we go. I don't know what that actually did, mind you. Well, that's helpful. It closed that on me. Is that what I was supposed to do, do you think? Uh, um, right. That didn't seem to do me any good. Oh, you've only got so much time to do it in. I don't know if I can do it in enough time. If I'd hit that first time, maybe. If I use my dash, I can't... Please? Yes! And now I've got to go... Like that, otherwise I'd die. Does that take me right back to the beginning of that level? Okay, no. Takes me just before that door, though. Why the hell? The dash doesn't always seem to work for this, I've noticed as well. There we go. That worked now. I don't know why, but it did. Okay, so now we need to... Okay, I think I get what I'm doing here. It's just a case of getting it right. And not and remembering to jump, more importantly. Remembering to jump is important. Come on, come on, come on. Damn! Close, but not close enough. There we go. We got through again. The only way I can see to get across here is to do this. Okay, so that opens that door. And then I get myself trapped back on the other side again. That's just stupid. Right, we're out. If I do that, I can't jump across the hole. I, I don't understand how I'm supposed to get across there. Maybe I can just jump it normally. Okay, so, the reason why that doesn't work every time, by the way, is if you do it without the... The, uh, without running in the direction you want to hit. Then it won't work properly. Oh, you can make it in one jump. Oh, that's why I needed to do that. That's why I needed to do it. I'm guessing. Yeah. Little trappy areas that are hard to get through. But we got there in the end. I think that pipe just takes us where this takes us, so... Right, okay, we need to rush towards that. So that we can duck and roll inside. Oh, and get out of this area. Thank goodness for that, that was horrendous. The sewers. Where do we go now? More sewers, of course. I think this bridge is probably collapsing behind us. Yep. Okay. I 
keep doing that. Right, get rid of the bat. That'll make it easy to get past. Yeah, you can do some pretty long jumps. As old bonkers T-Bobcat. Ah, okay. I can't jump on that one. Oh, I missed. Ah. <laughs> yeah, there are some... Okay, this counts as a, a middle section of the thing, thankfully. That's annoying. Okay, we made it to this one. Really? Right, this bat is just annoying. There we go, problem solved with the bat. Every time I... Is that timed to go when I jump? Let's try one more time. Without jumping this time. We'll try and make it through without jumping straight onto something. Yeah, this is a... It's a frustrating series of platforms. Makes it... And a bat makes it even worse. So it's two and then a mole. Okay. This doesn't seem to do much. Okay, wait, and then jump. Okay, and then we got to jump across buckets. Oh, this is like the more difficult platforming so far in the game is definitely this bit. Alright, so I need to go what? I may as well wait. If I hold to the right, I would probably have jumped into the bucket. We can definitely do this, it's just, it's just very frustrating the way that the, okay, now we're okay. Please give me an empty one. Oh, it's fine. It's, that's, that's just the most annoying part of that, is the fact that if you time it badly, there we go. I need one that's going up. And one that's going down. It's just too... Oh no. That's hard. I need to be a little bit higher than that. There we go. And then we've got to avoid all this. Okay, okay. Well, that would have been annoying. Imagine falling down because of that thing. There we go, right. 
I'm more concerned about getting out of here rather than who I have to face. Right, that seems to be the end of this section and I hope this is the final boss. We made it here at last. Oh, what is this? He's got like a... He's got like a Robotnik style machine. Or Dr. Eggman, if you prefer, although I always prefer to call him Dr. Robotnik. Because that was his name. As far as the UK market was concerned, anyway. Am I supposed to jump on that red link thing on top of its head, do you think? Electrocuted, of course. Well, that did something. So jumping on top of there looks like it is a good idea. You can get two hits on that if you jump. Although it's taking a bit of time. How, long, how many hits is it going to take to destroy him? Gone. Got him. And that. I'm assuming that's that, but then who knows? Maybe there's some other secret boss waiting. The underground stage has been cleared. Uh oh. Something else is coming. Those so called tune treasures are nothing but trinkets. What I have in store for you will bring the whole tune world to its knees. Ha, 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 ha. He's told them back. He's taken them away. What? What's going on? What's going on? Apparently we have to go in here. I guess that's not the end then. We've got electrical clouds. I don't, I'm, I'm assuming I can't destroy the storm cloud. That almost looks like a lightning rod. This is hard to avoid his attacks. Surely he can't attack me when I'm under here. Apparently he can. trouble is you have to make sure that he's not firing a bolt of lightning as you're jumping because otherwise it will stop you from jumping see and then there's that well, I thought I couldn't make that jump to be honest I was sure that I wasn't going to make it That deals with him. For next time. You're just constantly getting struck by lightning in this level. There doesn't appear to be any way to, to avoid it. Just wait. There we go. Okay, we're good. As long as I... Don't get hit by those things. I'm not sure that's the right way to go, to be honest. I'm not sure I can jump up there. I can. Good. I guess we're. I guess the whole point of this is to climb. Can't make that jump. I knew I couldn't make that jump as I went to do it, but you know, at that stage, you're kind of like, oh well, I've committed to it now, so. Can't get onto that. Not from here, at least. Oh, yes, we can. I'm surprised we've not had the lightning thing following us. Oh, are we at the boss fight already? Well, at the very least...
Okay, apparently... I can't fall off anything here, but I'm not sure how I'm going to beat him, to be honest. Do I have to wait until he's shooting up in the air like that? Oh, I got to hit him, hit him in the head. You got to shoot him in the head. Keeps that up. He's keeping that up because I'm on this side. I can't get to the other side, though. Is he ever going to lower that arm? Well, it seems like that will blow up if I keep shooting at it. I keep throwing at it. He's going to keep electrocuting me, though. Go away. Is that actually doing anything? Ah, I can squeeze between his between his knees and do that. I'm guessing he now won't lower this arm. And then the same again, right? Yeah, when that happens he uh Oh no. Go away. Right, how many more hits does he need to be to be gone, I wonder? Can't be many more, surely. Oh, I messed that up because I There we go. How much more? How many more times? How many more times? Surely. I think we got him. Yeah, because it's just bouncing off his head now. Toon World stage cleared! Apparently. Good. I've kept time for the entire Toon World for eons. And for what? Nothing. Not even a simple thank you or hint of gratitude. So it comes to this. Ah, here. Take back your treasures. But we will slip together into oblivion as I stop time forever. Ha ha ha. No, you won't. No, you won't. Because I say no. Thank you. What? What did you say? You thank me after everything I've done? Well, yeah, because you gave me the stuff back. After I saddened the heart of every tune in the world? Well, you, you did give these back. I can't remember what his voice is like. In a dark hour, one shining soul serves as a beacon for us all. Yeah, it ain't you, mate. You've renewed my faith in the world. And thereby saved everything. Time will continue as it always has. Thank you, Bonkers. It's my job, right? To solve crimes. Case closed, only 44 minutes and 31 seconds? Hey, lucky they gave us a medal for cracking the case. Oh yeah? What do I get for cracking my ribs? Dunno, cheer up, you've been decorated. You're right, Bonkers. Maybe you don't need me out there after all. Are you kidding? We're partners! Okay, okay. Just get off me. Partner? Partner. We did it. That was bonkers. Uh, an interesting platforming game based on, as I say, a Disney cartoon series.